going to do a little planner crafty supply haul I did this morning. Just got a few odds and ends I thought I would share. Um, I went looking for... Hold on, what did I do with it? I went looking for a better way to store all my sticker sheets. Like this that you get, these long, tall, floppy ones that I can leave out and I can see. And I was trying to find something that had individual divider pockets and stuff in it, and I couldn't. That's pre-made anyways. So I was playing around at the dollar store looking for nail polish, don't judge. And um, if you know my other channel, you'll know why I said that. <laughs> Um, and I found these, and I thought these would work perfect. I just have to figure out legs. There's four of them, and I could make them, you know, tall. And they're perfect slots for holding stickers up. So I, I haven't worked all the details out on that, but that's what my idea is for those. So we'll see where that comes from. If you want to know more about how that ends up, let me know, and I'll I'll do a video on it. But I gotta find something to put all these tall sticker sheets in. Window alarm. <laughs> so anyways, that, that's my idea so far. And then I went to, where did I go first? I don't know where I went first. I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, I went to Office Supply, Office Depot. I had to mail a package. If you don't mail your packages from Office Depot, you should. Oh my gosh. It's so much quicker. It's so much simpler. It's so much just nicer to ship there. Although, anybody else think that the postal rates are insane? Insane. I sent a little tiny box. Ten bucks. Oh, don't get me started. Anyways, I found, um, no, I didn't even find those there. I didn't find anything there. Never mind. Rant aside. I went to Target, had to get some half and half. If you drink half and half, they have the best prices on half and half. And I got these um, Ultra Glide gels to use in my uh, Faux Hobonichi. And I really like them. They're a 0.5 um, mm tip, so they're really, really fine. But they don't bleed through the paper. I guess if you held it there, it would. But I haven't found them to bleed through the paper yet. So um, it has a black, a blue, a light blue, a pink, and a green. And I really like these. Um, three, three or four dollars. They weren't very much at Target. I'm all over the place. Sorry. Then I popped over to Joann's. And I say pop over because it's clear across the city from me. Which is a good thing because I would be poor. -er. And I don't know how this worked out. Okay. So I found this die cuts with a view stack. And it's called Sky's the Limit. And I want to use it in my smoosh planner. And it has... Um, Sticker, two sticker sheets in the back and then glitter glitter type paper I have never seen the stack before um I have not haven't been keeping up with crafting stuff but I still haven't seen it before I found it in the dollar section it wasn't a dollar but here let me flip through I just thought these were fun and cheery and I just really really liked the colors love the umbrellas and the clouds and the words and, I mean, I guess everybody's probably seen these, but I had never seen them before. And there was a whole stack of them in the dollar section. I love the sticker cutout thing. Uh, this would be great to use. It's not stickers. It's a die cuts that you cut out yourself. But this would be great to use with the pick scan with your Cameo. Anyways, I, all, the die cut, all the paper stacks were 40% off. So I thought, well, I'm going to get it because I like it. I don't know why it was in the dollar section. But I get over there. And it was $6. And she goes, well, do you have a coupon to use with it? And I'm like, um, sure. So I gave her the 50% off coupon I had. I ended up bringing this home for $3. It all, I, I don't, it's a hot buy, I guess. Hot buy, two special, something like that. Anyways, it was $6 at Joann's. Used a 50% off coupon, got it for $3. Hello, like that. And that was the only thing I bought there because I was going to buy ATG tape because it's time to stock up on it again. And <laughs> they don't, they carry the ATG gun, but not the tape. Okay. Oh, I know what I got at Office Depot. I got post-it notepads. These gigantic post-it notepads are 64 cents. And so I picked up four of them. I actually opened one already. So then I went over to Hobby Lobby. Again, I was looking for... 
storage ideas and I, I always pick up if I don't use a coupon anything else and yes I actually do leave the store often without using my coupon I try to pick up an ATG refill um, but they had this in the clearance section and um, it was regularly $9.99 you know their paper paper page kits and this they had it marked down to $3.59 and they had a whole bunch of these and um, so I picked up one of those and it had a sticker it's got several sticker sheets in it and what else did it have on I guess I'm upside down but it just had I like the colors of it not so much the theme it you know but I use it in my smoosh planner so I don't care um, but I really liked the colors of it and so okay I can't figure out how to do this Anyways, it was $3.59 at Hobby Lobby. I like the arrows. More cut-aparts. A map. Stuff like that. But I really like the colors, so that's why I got it. But again, it was $3.59, and I went, oh, paper! <laughs> Have to buy. So I got that. And I think that was all that I got at Hobby Lobby. Yeah, and I got an ATG tape. And then I went to Michael's. And got an ATG tape because, as usual, they have nothing. <laughs> nothing. And then I went to the dollar store, or Dollar Tree, which you saw that I got the racks, those little wire racks from. Um, and they had these, um, I won't call them washi tape because they're not washi tape, but little tape, tape rolls. Um, but they're like, here's the pattern of this one and this one and this one. They had others in, in other colors, but I didn't really like the colors and... Um, okay, smarter than the average box. Here we go. But it looks like this, and I'm assuming it's a sticker. Yep, and then it's just a sticker. Not, It's got a plastic backer. But I thought that was cool. So I got those three. And now, of course, I'm going, gosh, I wish I got them all. No, I don't need any more. I don't need any more. You want to know how much I don't need any more tape? This is how much I don't need any more tape, but I keep buying it. And that's not even all of it, sadly, embarrassingly. But the other cool thing I found at the Dollar Tree was they had these scissors. They had other colors, but I like these colors. And I'm always looking for a pair of nice scissors like this. So I got uh, two of those, buck a piece, yes. And then they had these ballpoint uh, pens on sale. Retractable ball pipe, boy, bleh. <gasps> <sighs> ballpoint pins. They're a 1M, so they're a medium tip. But I thought it was really cool because um, it goes to the breast cancer research thing. They were a dollar. Can't beat that. And look at how pretty pink. So anyways, that's what I got. Go to Joann's and find that die cuts with a view thing if you want it. And I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Bye! Bye.